emotional roller coaster? I'm being strong. On Halloween of last year, Shelly Hall was at the doctor with her daughter, Mary Beth Ezel. You kept falling. Her family watched as a normally active preteen got clumsier. That was one of the reasons they decided to take her to the doctor. When the doctors came in and they said that it's diffuse intrinsic pontine glioma, I just had to look at, <laughs> I had my aunt in there with me and I had to look at her and she said, so it's DIBG. And then when, when they confirmed it, and it's October just like everything stopped. Shelly says she had heard of DIPG from other cases along the Gulf Coast the past few years. Because that's what that's what it looked like to me. The past nine months, their family has been doing everything they can to help Mary Beth fight the rare disease. It's only rare until it happens to you. Hey, Yeah. Yeah. I'm right. Yeah, I'm right. They just finished up a clinical trial in Cincinnati, but are now trying out a different treatment closer to home at UAB in Birmingham. It doesn't happen overnight. Yeah. While continuing to make every memory count. And we are trying to make every day the best day. Mary Beth's family says support from the community has helped them cope with this diagnosis. And it's something that can tear families apart, but I really do believe it's brought us stronger together. But her father, Sean, says Mary Beth's strengths keep them afloat. What's your three Bs? Brave. Brave. Beautiful. And bold. Nicolette Schleisman, WKRG News 5.